I made this rule up based on a bunch of things, uh, but we're going to call it stay two steps ahead. Okay. And so this one is about like you always need to be a, a be prepared and mm-hmm. ahead. And this was actually, we had talked about Amy, who's in the room, for example. Oh, yeah. Um, Let's just, talk about Amy. Yeah, just give, give, that, give that example, like the thing that we've talked about a bunch. Yeah. So... Uh, so Amy, who's in the room, we'll see if we can embarrass her. I don't yeah. think it's possible. She's not on camera, so she won't get embarrassed. Yeah, that's true. I can't see her through these lights. <laughs> uh, so Amy, I thought she recently went on vacation. Where'd you go, Amy? Italy. 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 She went to Italy. Shout out, Italy. Yeah. Those pictures were nice. Yeah, it was great. We were looking at the pictures. They were amazing. Mm. Uh, so anyway, she went to Italy. But one thing that I remarked to Dave it was how amazing of a job Amy did in preparing for her being gone mm. from the office. Yep. And um, and so she had spent, I didn't know this, but she it seems like she had, and you can talk more about this, spent time uh, working on a plan yep. to make sure that nothing was going to be dropped while she was gone. And so while she was gone, of course, nothing was dropped. Everything kept going great. And, uh, and to me, I looked at that and said, like, wow, that's an amazing thing that very few people do to be that yeah. prepared i think i think it took it took seeing that to realize how few people actually do mm-hmm. that mm-hmm. and so amy had this trip plan and basically so we our one-on-one is on monday afternoons and basically a month prior to this every single one-on-one she was like reminder i'm gonna be out here's a here's the six things that i have going on between now and then and she just basically had wrote the whole playbook of like what do you need for me between now and then what do you need for me between now and then and, and had the whole thing written out and so she had you know uh, she's a designer and marketer, so all of her video content designs, images, you know, everything was ready mm-hmm. and and scheduled, gone. Yep. And so she was out for ten days, and we didn't miss a beat. And that was a that that's the thing that you realize that a lot of people don't do is because a lot of people it all just starts with self awareness. I'm going to be out for X amount of time. How does that impact the other people on on the team around me? And so this yeah. is why I call this one the stay two steps ahead because it starts with thinking about. How you're gonna, how the things you do have an impact on everybody else mm-hmm. on, on the team. And that's the biggest example of we, not me. Absolutely. So that's leadership uh, shining through right there through yeah. Amy. Amy's a leader, a natural right. born leader. So that's so what it is. Back to promos. Yeah. Like yeah. I often see people who want, in my history, in my life, people who've wanted to be promoted, who, but who can't be gone for two hours without something going wrong, right? Totally. Right. And so they're not staying two steps ahead. Totally. All right. So though, that's, that's, that's today. DC's three rules for getting promoted, the 120 and 6 rule, do 120% of your job for a minimum of six months. Show it, number two, show it before you get the title. You got to have people thinking that way before you actually get the promotion. And then number three, stay two steps ahead. You got to be prepared in order to get it. AKA the Amy rule. AKA the Amy rule. That's the a Amy better rule. rule. That's, that, a, that's, that's how you make that memorable. Yeah.